In this tutorial, we will see two new workarounds for using our OFX plugins with Resolve Fusion. One of our workarounds is not working anymore in Fusion, so we'll start with what not to do and then show you the workarounds that do currently work. In the previous tutorial, I told you to add a generator the length of your proposed new clip length to the track below and select the clip and the generator and make a compound clip and then go to Fusion. That process is now generating undesirable results. So instead of that method, I will now show you two new options for the desired results. Let's start with the first workaround option. Instead of the original clip plus a generator on the bottom track, you can use just one single video track and duplicate the clip as many times as you want. This would be equal to or longer than the desired result length. Next, you will go to Fusion and apply Twixter and adjust your speed percentage to whatever you want. I'll make it 50% in the inspector and see that it now works as expected. The next suggested workaround option. We can add a generator on the second track and extend the length and then select both clips, but instead of making a compound clip, use new fusion clip. Now we add Twixter again, or whatever plugin you want, and change the speed percentage in the inspector, and voila, that also works. These two new options should give you the desired results and workflow that you need to use our plugins in Resolve Fusion. Mm -hmm.